Yeah, I mean, uh, fishing in Iceland is like one of the best places on the earth. People travel all over the world every year to come fish here, so. And this is where I come in. I did travel across the world to fish in Iceland with the goal of catching some humongous brown trout. But what I didn't realize is how humbled I would get by the difficulty of fishing, the terrain, the weather. And for this trip, I was just along as a passenger. Oh, me and my hands are so cold. Yeah, dude, we're like super lost. Well, I just flipped my, <laughs> my nose. That's a new volcano starting today. Making new lava, so. Now that new erupting volcano, it is located here. And we're fishing here. But not to worry, we have a local trusted fishing guide to keep us safe. But, yeah, I think we should keep on fishing. And stop jogging around. <laughs> what do you think? Yeah. Fashion tail. Who works everywhere. <laughs> you have to be really accurate on the cast and, and take exactly the right drift on the fly. Unless it's not that likely you catch some. Okay, fish. Yeah, you, you caught it. Oh no. You way. caught a fish. No way. He's in. Try to get really close to him. It feels like when you're hooking a rock. So, like, yeah. This is one of the big, big guys in the, in the river. This is, uh. Look at the size of that thing. Look at the size of that thing. <laughs> That's 78 centimeters, 31 inch brown trout. It's pretty fun to spot them and, and sight fish them and like we did. There's a, like a total dream coming true from you, Eric, like sight fishing a 31 inch zero, like nine feet in front of you. <laughs> they, they act like a train when they are that, that big, like over that size, yes. they act like a train. They just go like a tow truck. The weather is always changing. We had like sunshine today. We had like a rain, we had wind, we have a lot of rain. And yeah, it's always changing. And then you never know is you just look at the forecast and you're hoping it's going to be fine. I mean, look at that thing. It's soaked all the way through. We can get snow here like tomorrow. The wind will change. So like yesterday, we have sun lotion. We're ready for that. And the day after we're wearing down jacket and maybe a spare one in the car, so it's different. Weather changes quick. Let's go, baby. Where are we going? Akkereri. Yeah, I like to fish fast over water. Like I know roughly where the fisher will be holding, so I wanna cover as much water as I can and be changing flies changing tactics, doing nymphing, dry dropper, that kind of stuff. Okay, yep. Yes! Yes! Keep him upstream, keep him upstream. So yeah, look at Oh! oh. Just look at how, how wide he is. Look at his belly's all. Dude, dude, that was awesome. So we'll just give this five minutes, and then we'll go again. There's another one in there, so I cast. Oh! <laughs> Bring him to you, back here, back behind you. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! No, so. Fish. Oh. <laughs> it's a little bit bigger. Maybe step. A little yeah. bit bigger. See for a minute just jumping, jumping, holding the tail, kind of dancing on the water. Do it all the time. They go crazy. Oh yeah. You're getting gradually bigger. Oh! Sloppy net job, but we got him.
I was like, that didn't take long. And then that trout took off and started fighting, went right in these riffles, of course, all the way down, all the way up, and then he got caught on a rock. So he's on the other side. Billy went all the way down there, across the bridge. Well, that was entertaining anyway. First four minutes, hook into a huge brown trout. Get stuck on the other side of the river. Is there a guy getting permission from the local farmer to let us fish? <laughs> okay, I'll put it away though. Yes! <laughs> It was just sitting right there. He's good. Oh. <laughs> Dude, that was... Oh my... God, look at the size of that thing. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my God, that's crazy. and you lose many of them. It's not easy to cut the trout here, but when you cut them, they can be quite big. And in this kind of water, the, the battle can be amazing. This is when you see pictures of ice, and this is what, this is what you see. Yeah. Blue skies and then the green, the blue water, just unbelievable yeah. scenery. Yeah. Girth of that thing. And it's just in a perfect condition. It's like, like look at the colors, like the healthy colors. You have the yellow on the bottom. I mean, he's got a little blue spot right behind his eye. Oh! oh. Wow! Oh, he doesn't even fit in the net. It's dramatic. It's it's fun, you know. You never know. You never know that what's gonna happen in the next chapter. That's that's exciting, isn't it? There's a rock there. Yeah. There's a rock there. Yeah. And there's a rock down there. They're normally above these rocks or below them. Most of the time, though, more of more often above them. Okay, do it again, similar, very good. You're stuck in the stone. Just go and get it, it's fine. You fist it. It was not stuck. <laughs> that was, was it hooked when I was yanking on it? Yeah, it was funny. You, you were, no way, no way. I, I just can't believe it. <laughs> Wow! Another monster, man! That's a, I think it could be the longest one. Look at that. Look at that trout. Dude, My that's, friend. That's, every one I catch is bigger than the last one. Yeah. The third one today, this is the longest one, 66. Yeah. Oh my word. You're not even looking at me because you're, you're, you're beloved bugs. You need to keep your eyes a little more open. Maybe take your face shield off. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> it was like, it's fine. Just in my ear for like a week after that, like a fuss in my ear for a week. If they're so loud when there are so many of them. It's like a beekeeper. Mm -hmm. The camera, man. You have a glove for, glove for camera, man. Oh. When you say guys with less skills, you're, you're not talking about us, for sure. You're talking about somebody else, right? No, I'm talking about you guys, because <laughs> you're always tangling, and, and, and I'm always trying to tell you where to put the fly, but it always lands somewhere else. And then you tangle like a stack, and you have lost, like, 50 flies for me, and I 
that will charge you a lot. Yeah, that was, that was like a high five grip. Yeah, like, <laughs> like... Dude, give us a real smile, man. That was a soft ninja. Yeah, that was a soft ninja. That's, that's exciting, isn't it? It is exciting. Mm. Seems to know what he's talking about. We haven't seen his guiding license yet. Oh! oh. <laughs> you know, and when you wade deep like this, you find out where all the leaks are in your waders that you never knew. Don't show anybody this. This, yeah. is, this is our secret. Kasi mestarin. Kasi super cut. Third one. Think about that. The third one was your biggest ever. Ah, my biggest ever. Next one. That's my biggest ever. Third one. And that's my biggest ever. Where can you get this? Until I catch the next one. Be the biggest ever. I exactly. said